Uh, guys, where am I right now? And wait, Jordy, what? You're here too? Oh, uh, how did we get here? And, uh, what? What is it? Bro, oh my gosh. Where am I? Humans, why am I here? You must be the humans that put me here. What, Jordy, did you put us here? Uh, I didn't put you here. Uh, Tora did. Wait, what? No, I didn't put us here. Why would I, why do you think I put us here? Tora did? Well, he better have a way to get me off this place. Uh, and I think we have a bigger problem. Huh? And, uh, what the heck is that? <laughs> Finally, you've awoken. It is I, the G-Man Toilet, and I have your Wait, son. Wait, is that my baby? Daddy, daddy, help! And if you ever want to see him again, you're going to have to meet me at the bottom. <laughs> Dad, please save me, please! Oh my gosh, did you guys see that? He had your son! We have to get him back. Okay, yeah, this is really not good. We have to figure out how to get your son back, and uh, I think I might have a plan. Uh, why should I trust your plan? You're probably working with the guy. Wait, what? What are you talking about? Why would I be worried for the G-Man? Obviously, I'm not worried for G-Man. He's, like, evil and stuff, and uh, I don't know if you know me, but I'm actually a good guy. Well, you're a human, and all I know is I don't trust humans. No, come on, Titan Speaker Man. You can trust me. You can trust me. I promise. I don't trust humans. Yeah, you're probably working for him. What? No, guys, no! Ah, no! Uh, guys, guys, I cannot believe you literally just punched me off. And Jordy, why don't you trust me? We've literally been best friends for so long. But uh, wait a minute. When you guys punched me off, I actually noticed something. What did you notice? Well, if you go into third person, you look down. We're actually on a one chunk island, but there's a bunch of different layers. Yeah, I'm sure you just noticed that. And uh, it looks like some of these layers are going to be pretty tough to get through, so we're definitely going to want to get to work. And uh, Titan Speaker Man, if you're ever going to want to save your baby, we're definitely going to have to get to the very bottom of this chunk. Fine, if that's the only option, but that doesn't mean I trust you. That's okay, you don't have to trust me for now, but uh, Jordy, why don't we get started by breaking down some of these trees so we can get some tools? Yeah. So I'll go ahead and mine this one over here, and you can get that one. And with this wood we're getting, we should be able to make some tools to hopefully get down to the next layer. And uh, what the? Okay, you guys got a crafting table? That's awesome. Yeah, we worked together on it. Nice, good job. Now that we have a crafting table, we should be able to make our first tools out of wood. So I'll just go ahead and in the crafting table, make some sticks just like this. And then I should be able to make us some pickaxes. Here's two pickaxes. Why don't you take one, Titan Speaker Man, and Jordy here. You could have one too. Well, thanks, Tora. Of course, Jordy, and then I'll go ahead and make myself one right here, and now we can actually dig down right here to get to the next layer. Wait a minute, is that obsidian? Oh my gosh, this is gonna take forever to mine through. All right, guys, well, we don't have much time, so just pick out a block and get mining. Hold on, guys, I think I have an idea. Everyone back up. Uh, okay. Uh, okay. Uh. What the? You know, what the? Oh my gosh, wait, did that actually just work to get through the obsidian? What can I say? I am pretty heavy. Uh, okay, well, I mean, yeah, I guess you were able to get through the obsidian, which is awesome, because now we don't have to mine all of that, and, uh, it looks like we're able to get to the next layer, which is just stone. Look, we made it to the stone level, so now we can finally get better tools. Yeah, you're right, Jordy, that's awesome. So why don't we just go ahead and start mining it? Wait, what the heck? Oh my gosh, is that a silverfish? Uh-oh, guys, watch out, silverfish are so annoying. Okay, oh my gosh, he's doing a ton of damage. Yeah, we gotta take this guy out, and I don't even have a sword yet. Okay, I'm gonna have to kill with this pickaxe. Come on, dude, you're going down. And, uh, what the heck, Jordy, are you building up running away from the silverfish help me kill this thing look how scary he is all right that's fine jordy i'll deal with it myself and titan speaker man why aren't you helping me either i don't get why you guys are scared of some rats i'm not scared of just one of them but uh when they start multiplying they get really scared i mean look at how many are down there okay well it looks like they are mostly just trapped down there so maybe i should try to make a wooden sword just like this and uh I guess maybe I could jump down there and try and take him out. You got this, Tora. I believe in you. All right. Well, uh, here goes nothing. And uh, just jump down here. And, oh, my gosh. Yeah, I'm taking them all out with my sword. But, uh, okay, wait. This actually might not be a good idea. There's so many of them. What the heck? How did so many of them get down here? Oh, no. Jordy, help. Jordy, quick. Jordy, help. Get down here. No, please. Please. <laughs> Well, that was kind of entertaining. Okay, yeah, maybe jumping to that pit full of silverfish was not the best idea. Uh, what if we let them come up here? No, Jordy, absolutely do not let them come up here. I think if we just hit down on them, we should be able to take them all out. Jordy, you're actually taking them all out? Oh my gosh, you're doing so much damage. And it looks like almost all of them are dead. Uh, yeah, there's not many left. And yeah, it looks like there's just like a couple more. So I'll jump down here and make sure I finish the rest of them. And I think there's just one more. Oh, there's still more over there. Oh my gosh. How do these guys keep on coming? Where are they even coming from? Okay, take these last ones out. And I think we should be good. All right, Jordy. Well, it looks like that whole stone layer was just infested stones. So uh, we weren't able to get any of that stone because it all turned into silverfish. And this is granite, which means we keep getting the worst blocks. Yeah, this is not good because we can't even use granite to make better tools or anything. But uh, I guess we could just mine some of this in case we 
need some extra blocks. Oh wait, Tora! What? Not all the stone was infested. Look, there's oh some gosh. right here. Oh yeah, there is actually some stone right here. That's perfect. We literally needed this to get some tools. Now we can just go ahead and grab this. And it looks like this should be enough stone for us to get some better tools. Yeah, this is perfect. And Jordy, how much stone were you able to grab? I only got three, but here you go. You can have it. All right, thank you. I'll take that. And then I should be able to come up here and make some more sticks just like this. And now I should be able to make a stone pickaxe. Guys, it's getting pretty dark. Don't you humans like to build houses to protect you from the mobs? Oh yeah, mob spawn at nighttime and we have no shelter. Yeah, you guys are totally right. We don't have a shelter right now. And if it turns nighttime, the mobs will spawn and kill us all. And uh, I don't know about you guys, but I do not want to get killed by some mobs tonight. So uh, why don't we go ahead and build a house? Yeah, but where should we put it? Well, uh, I like this corner over here. I think we can build our house in this corner. And uh, if we're going to want to build a house quick enough, we're all going to have to get to work. All right, Titan Spear Man, here's a wooden shovel. I need you to start gathering some of this dirt so we can use it to build a house. And Jordy, I'm going to make you a stone pickaxe right here so you can help me gather some of the quartz downstairs so we can also use that to build up our house. Well, mobs are actually scared of me, but... If it's going to speed up the process of getting my son back, I guess I could help you out. All right. Thank you, Titan Speaker Man. Awesome. He's grabbing some dirt and we can head down and start grabbing some of this quartz. And oh my gosh, wait, what the heck is that? Melons under the quartz? That's so weird. All these layers are so random, but at least we were able to get some stone pickaxes so we can grab a bunch of this quartz. And with all that dirt upstairs, we should be able to build ourselves a house. All right. While you're grabbing that dirt, I'm going to go ahead and start building the walls of our house, which I'll just go ahead and put right here so we can build all of this up. All right, Titan Speaker Man, I ran out of granite. So while you go ahead and take this smooth quartz and start building up the walls while I go get some more blocks. All right, let's see. And oh my gosh, yes, we got all of our walls up for our house. This is perfect. And Jordy, you got a door up. That's awesome. Let's go. And then now we can just go ahead and put a roof on the inside. And uh, I only have a couple dirt blocks left. So I guess I can put all of this right here just like that. And uh, that's all my blocks, Jordy. Do you have any more blocks? Yeah, I can use the rest of my blocks. And perfect, our house is complete. I think that's perfect timing because yeah, it literally just turned night. And oh my gosh, yeah, wait, I hear some mobs and there's literally a skeleton right there. This is not good. Uh, I think we could use some beds to skip the night. Yeah, beds would be super useful right now, but Jordy, I don't think there's any way we could get wool to make beds. Well, actually, when I was watching you guys mine down there, I think I saw some cobwebs. What? There's a cobweb layer? Oh my gosh, yeah, wait, that could literally be perfect because then we could break it to get string and then we would be able to make beds. Yeah, that's a great idea. All right, human, off you go to collect those cobwebs. Yeah, Tori, you got this. Go get them. Wait, what? what? Why am I being the one forced to go get the cobwebs? Why don't you go get them, Jordy? Oh, well, you know I'm too scared to go down there. Yeah, human. I mean, it's only fair. Uh, Tide Spear Man, why are you making me go down there? Why don't you go get them? Do you see the size of that hole? I can't fit down there. Uh, okay, yeah, I guess you're right. You probably don't fit down there, but, uh, all right, whatever. I guess I'll be the one to go and find the cobwebs, son. And, uh, hopefully I can avoid all these mobs by going down this hole. Let's see, where even is this cobweb layer that he was talking about? Okay, through here, there's nothing, just some melons, which, actually, these melons are good, because I was getting a little hungry, so I'll just munch on a couple of these. And, oh, uh, wait, is this iron? Okay, actually, this might be good. We can grab some iron, which we can use for some tools, so that's awesome. Okay, and where is this cobweb layer that he's talking about? Is it all the way down there? That looks so far. And actually, you know what I should be able to do? If I'm able to grab some of these blocks just like this, with these blocks, what I should be able to do is actually just make a staircase all the way down to the cobwebs. And I should be able to just keep building just like this all the way down. Yeah, oh my gosh, I'm skipping so many layers. This is awesome. And then this one right here. Okay, yeah, we're just about to make it. And I should be able to jump right here. And yes, we made it to the cobwebs. And Oh no, this is not good. My stone pickaxe is so slow at mining through these ores, but I guess we'll just have to do it slowly. We should be able to just break through that. And now we can grab ourselves all of this string. And we're actually going to need a lot of this string to make three beds. So let's just grab as much of this as we can. Okay, and we just grab this right here. And oh my gosh, wait, my sword just broke. And I'm not going to be able to make another sword. We are only able to get 24 string. And 24 string only makes six wool, which is enough to make two beds. Well, I guess we can head back up and go tell Jordy and Titan Speaker Man what happened. All right, guys, I'm back. I was able to find the lair with all the cobwebs, but uh, we have a little bit of a problem. Uh, what's the problem? Well, I was only able to get six wool, which means I only have enough to make two beds. Well, that's perfect. That's enough beds for me and Jordy. And then you can go keep watch outside. What? Why don't I get a bed? I have to keep watch outside? That is not fair. Says the person that trapped us here. I literally did not trap us here. I don't know why you think I trapped us here. I mean, did I do enough by going and getting this wool for you? Well, I mean, usually I don't sleep in a bed anyways. I'm a Titan Speaker Man. I just power off and go into a corner. 
Wait, what? So you were gonna take one of the two beds just because and you don't even need a bed? All right, well, whatever. Jordy, why don't you go ahead and put a crafting table down so we can make these beds? All right, here you go, Tora. Thank you, Jordy. Now I should be able to take all of this and let's go ahead and make two beds just like that. And now we've got two beds. So, uh, Jordy, I'll go ahead and put yours right here. And then I can put my bed right here. And now we got our beds down. We should be able to sleep through the night. Good night, guys. I'll see you in the morning. Oh, man, I slept so good. And Jordy, how'd you sleep? That was some really, really good sleep. Yeah, I really needed that. But uh, oh, is uh, Titan Speaker Man still sleeping? Uh, uh, let me just... Uh, all right. Hey, hey, what, what? Oh, it's you guys. Tori, hey, you. What? What? Jordy, I... I was trying to wake him up. Of course you did, you traitor. Hey, hey, no, no, stop hitting me. I was just trying to wake you up, man. Come on. All right, well, it's a new day, and uh, I actually found something when I went down to go get the cobwebs. What'd you find? Was it cute piggies? Uh, no, it was not cute piggies, Jordy. How would cute piggies be useful for us right now? I mean, I, I mean, they're cute. Jordy, what I found was actually even better than cute piggies, and what it was is actually some lucky blocks. Lucky blocks? What can we do with those? Well, what the lucky blocks do is if we break them, they have a chance to give us something really good or a chance to give us something really bad. And actually, we can get super overpowered items and weapons that can help us kill G-Man. That sounds good and all, but you're probably going to give us the bad ones, huh? What? I don't even have a say in which ones we get. It's all random. That's what I just said. So uh, you might get something good or you might get something bad, but normally it's something good. I don't know. Yeah, is this another one of your pranks you always do on me, Tora? No, guys, this is not a prank. I'm gonna go open Lucky Blocks, and uh, you guys should probably come with me so we can get geared up and fight G-Man. And uh, the Lucky Blocks are actually all the way down here. So, uh, guys, which one do you think I should break first? Uh, I think you should pick that one. That one? Which, which one does that one even mean? The one you're looking at! I'm looking at, like, 40 of them, Jordy. Just tell me which one! Literally the one right there! Move, let me do it. Oh, okay, and, oh, wait, what? Oh, what'd you even get? Some puny armor. Ew. Chainmail armor? This stuff isn't even that good, but it is pretty rare. Okay, well, that seemed like a pretty neutral lucky block. It didn't really do anything great, but it also didn't do anything bad, so I guess that's good. Well, uh, I want to try breaking this one all the way in the corner right here. So, uh, here goes nothing, and we can just break it in. Oh my gosh, what the heck? And I got a hero pickaxe. Okay, this is so cool, because now I can mine through all of this so much quicker. And uh, now I don't even need any of that iron or smelting, because I got a super cool diamond pickaxe that you don't have. Ha <laughs> ha. Well, mine's going to be better than your guys's. Look. And what? What the heck, Jordy? Why did you spawn your killing titans? Speaker Man! Oh no, I'm, I'm gonna dying. save you! No! Oh, okay, Jordy, you literally just killed Titan Speaker Man and now he's gonna think that's my fault! What the heck was that for, Tora? What? That was literally not me! You saw Jordy break it! Uh, I think that was you, Tora. Jordy, how are you also gonna blame me for this one? This was not me. Well, whatever. Anyways, you spawned in a super cool lucky block pyramid. Give us even more lucky blocks. Why don't we all pick a lucky block and break it at the same time? Okay, I want this one. Okay, and I'll pick this one right here. I guess I'll have this one. Well, here goes nothing. Break Break it on three in one, two, three, and go. And wait, okay, well, I got uh, some diamond boots. That kind of sucks. What did uh, you guys get? I got a villager. What the heck? A hero villager? Does this guy even have anything good? And well, it looks like he trades diamond tools for a lot of diamonds. This doesn't even seem like a fair trade. This is the worst villager I've ever seen. Yeah, I'm killing him. This is the worst villager I ever saw in my life. This is like totally a scam trade. Get over here, bro. You're, you're going down. Yep, okay, he's dead. That was, that was such a scam. Oh my gosh, what the heck? I just broke another lucky block and it spawned a big lucky block. And it looks like I flicked this lever to open it. And what is happening? Oh my gosh, Jordy, you're inside of the lucky block. Quick, get out of there. What and is oh, going on? Oh my gosh. Whoa, okay. That just bought a bunch of fireworks. And wait, did it give us diamonds? Yeah, look, it gave us diamonds and emeralds. And wow, we have so much space in here now. That's awesome. Okay. But it did blow up our house. Yeah, our house is a little bit destroyed, but that's fine because it is daytime. So we probably don't really need it. But uh, we were able to get 19 diamonds and 24 emeralds. Okay, well, why don't we keep up breaking a couple more of these lucky blocks to see if we can get some more resources and not another stupid villager with scam trades. I bet he's working with G-Man. Wait, well, okay. Well, yeah, I mean, I probably was going to kill him anyways, but uh, we had no reason to think he was working for G-Man. Why are you so suspicious that everyone's working for G-Man? Because everyone is. Whatever. I'm just going to keep on breaking these lucky blocks and uh, wait, what the? Oh my gosh, Bob. Ah, he's got such good stuff. Jordy, get over here. Quick. There's this guy named I'm, Bob. He's trying to kill I'm me. I'm fixing the house. No, Jordy. Okay, I'm just going to have to hit him off. <gasps> Come on. 
Gosh, okay, well, Jordy, get down here and help me kill this Bob guy. I kind of like him. Don't worry, you got it, Tora. I'm taking him out. Oh my gosh, he got me so low again this time, and Pegasus is not good at killing things. But maybe if I do kill him, he'll drop all of his armor and sword and stuff, so it might be good if I don't hit him off. And wait a minute, I did get his sword, but it's about to break. Oh my gosh, that is so bad. And uh, wait a minute, what is this? A lucky potion? Negative 100 luck? Oh my gosh, I've got a good idea. Uh, Jordy, Jordy. Uh, I found some lucky potions that make you lucky because if you look at it, it's named lucky potion Which means it makes you super oh lucky. Oh my gosh. Can I please have it? Yeah, here take a couple Uh, just drink all of them and <gasps> that should make you so lucky. Wait, what? <clears throat> what the heck Tori? Did you just prank me? I told you he's gonna be trusted. No, 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 Jordy I actually gave you the wrong ones. Okay. Here are the actual ones you're supposed to use. Okay. Thank you so much, Tora. Yeah, and why don't you go ahead and throw him in? Wait, whoa, oh my gosh, wait, that gave me so much health, and look, it even gave us a horse. And a bunch of armor, this is incredible. Yeah, well, the armor is kind of bad, and uh, we probably are gonna wanna get at least diamond armor for this fight, Jordy. Titan Speaker Man, you haven't opened a lucky block in a while, so why don't you go ahead and open another one, and uh, you can use that pickaxe to make it a little quicker. All right, I'll do this one. Okay, and wait, whoa. what, TNT? I'm glad I got it, and you didn't. All right, I'm just gonna keep speed run. Kind of sucks. Off. Wait, what the heck? Oh my gosh, TNT, run! Get away, guys! Get away! Ah! You guys aren't very good at this game. Uh, but we made it to redstone, ice, and wood. What the heck? Oh my gosh! Yeah, wait, that TNT did blow us up, but it did get us a lot lower. And uh, we yeah, we've now made it to redstone, and we even have some wood now. This is really good because I think we were getting low on wood. And cake? Is that cake? Oh my gosh, cake, yes, I love cake. This is perfect. I think these lucky blocks are not very lucky. Yeah, I feel like these are doing more harm than good. But when are we gonna get to that cute pig layer? Jordy, there's no cute pig layer. I already told you that. You're just making that up in your head. Nah, G-Man definitely put one down there somewhere. Uh, I really don't think he did, but uh, maybe, maybe we'll find one. But I guess the next step would be to keep digging down. All right, and Titan Speaker Man, here you go. You can have this enchanted diamond sword. Uh, this is like basically broken. Oh, was it? Uh, I guess that's a shame. Well, that's the only extra diamond sword I had, so I guess you'll have to make that one last. Pretty convenient, don't you think? And, uh, Jordy, here's your diamond sword and your diamond pickaxe. And, oh, Titan Speaker Man, I also have a diamond pickaxe for you right here. At least I can use this one. And now that we got our diamond tools, we should be able to actually just start digging straight down. But we might want to be careful here because I actually don't know what is below us. And we could actually dig into like lava or something. So Jordy, why don't you come over here and start helping me in? Oh my gosh, wait, there's some more cobwebs right here I forgot about. And what the heck? Tight speaker, man. How'd you get all the way over here? Uh, from your path from last night? Oh yeah, I forgot I made this path. That would probably have been useful to use before. Well, whatever. We're all the way back down here now. If we we're able to get an enchanting table, we might be able to enchant something. Yeah, we definitely need to do that to defeat G-Man. Let's go ahead and just keep on mining down and, uh, okay, we made some sand block. And wait, Jordy, watch out. There's magma blocks right there. Wait, what do those do? Wait, no, ow, Jordy, don't ow, step on those. Oh my ow, gosh, those step. damage you. Okay, oh how do you gosh. not realize that those magma blocks damage you? Oh my gosh. You could have warned me. That was such a noob move, Jordy. What are you even thinking? All right, well, what's down here? Um, Jordy, are we floating right now? Uh, I think it's glass. Oh, yeah, no, wait, we're definitely standing on glass. Okay, so we should be able to just break that. Well, we made it to the mossy cobblestone layer so we can dig down and wait a minute, Jordy, look at what I found. Oh my gosh, are those diamonds? We're rich. Yeah, we're literally rich now. This is awesome. We should be able to all make diamond armor now. I love diamonds so much. Let's just grab all of these. Okay, Jordy, well, I have over 32 diamonds, which should be enough for me to make some armor. How many do you have? Yeah, I have 30 as well, and I'm so excited. Awesome. Well, why don't we go ahead and make another crafting table just like this, and let's go ahead and turn some of our diamonds into diamond armor. And uh, I already got some boost from a lucky block, so I should just need to make a helmet, chest plate, and leggings. And now I'm fully kitted in some diamond. Let's go. Well, if you humans like diamonds, maybe you'll like what I just found. Wait, what? Oh my gosh. Wait, is that ancient debris? Jordy, get over here. Wait a minute, this means we can make netherite. Give it to me, give it to me, come on. Oh my gosh, calm down, Jordy, it's not going anywhere. Like, it's all gonna be right here for you. I need it right now. And, uh, Jordy, you're kind of going crazy for netherite. I love netherite. Oh my gosh, okay, well, I guess I'll just leave you two mining that, Jordy, but I, uh, I have a little bit of a problem. We can't really make netherite ingots without some gold. Uh, human, look up. Oh wait, yeah, there's literally gold right there. I totally forgot about that. So yeah, Jordy, you keep mining all that netherite and I'll go up here and start getting ourselves some gold. And then if we combine the two, we should be able to get a bunch of netherite ingots, which should be super powerful to help us defeat G-Man. 
All right, Jordy, I was able to get us a bunch of gold and uh, hopefully you're able to get us a bunch of netherite. So now we just need to cook the gold. All right, I got a furnace so we can cook the gold. Perfect, I'll go ahead and put that in there. Now we need to make a smithing table. Two iron, we just put it up here just like that. And then four wood at the bottom and now we have a smithing table. So then once we get our ancient debris and our gold, we can actually turn it into netherite. Well, I think I got kind of a lot. And oh my gosh, you got over a stack of ancient debris. Yeah, that's perfect. Oh, and Jordy, we actually do need to smell all this ancient debris, so why don't you go ahead and put down another furnace? And there you go. So now we can put all of this in here just like that. And then I'll take some of this coal from this side and put it in here. So now we just gotta wait for all this to smelt. All right, well, it's been cooking for a while, so here's some gold and some scraps. Awesome, thank you so much, Jordy. Okay, now we can put the netherite scraps just like this and the gold in here as well. And yes, we got our netherite ingots. So now I can just take off all of this diamond armor and throw it in here with the netherite and boom. Look how cool I look. Oh my gosh, yeah, Jordan, we literally look so awesome. But wait, I also want to upgrade my tools. So let me make a couple more netherite just like this. And now I should be able to upgrade my sword and my pickaxe. And now I have a netherite hero's pickaxe. That is so cool. Oh, uh, but where did Titan Speaker Man go? Uh yeah, wait, what the heck? You make a really good point, Jordy. Where is he? He was over here and... Oh, wait, there's a staircase here. Maybe he was digging down. And wait, Titan Speaker Man, there you are. Have you been digging this whole time? Uh, yeah, I need to get my son and you guys just kept messing around. We weren't messing around. We were getting super powerful tools so that we could kill G-Man. Listen, I get you guys want to look cool and all, but my son's life is at stake right now. Yeah, we probably don't have much time, so we should probably get going. I have a super powerful pickaxe now, so why don't I help you dig down? With this, me and Jordy should be able to mine super fast, and look at how quick we're going. And wait, is this an observer level? That's so weird. Okay, well, let's just keep on heading down, and we should be able to make it all the way to G-Man. And watch out, Jordy. We need to make sure these anvils don't fall on our head, because that would be super embarrassing. What? Is this stairs? Yeah, it looks like there's a stairs level too. That's super weird. And fences too. Oh my gosh, these levels are so weird. All right, and wait. Oh no, Jordy, look at that. Is that more silverfish? Yeah, Jordy, there's more silverfish. This is not good. We have to take these out quick before they multiply. Yeah, this is not good at all. Oh my gosh, not this again. And wait, Jordy, I just fell down. Oh no, I need this netherite armor to really protect me here quick. Jordy, help. Oh no, Titan Speaker Man, help us! I still can't believe you guys are just scared of rats. These guys are way more powerful than rats. I mean, look at how many there are. Quick, oh my gosh. Oh, I have no clue how I got out of there. And wait a minute, are they all chasing me and falling off? Jordy, it looks like most of them fell down. I think there's just a couple left. And yes, all the silverfish are dead. Let's go. And let's see, how far are we from the bottom? Oh my gosh, wait, we're getting pretty close. And what, is that diamonds down there? Wait, those are even better diamonds. Oh my gosh, let's go. There's literally diamonds. This is so cool. We thought we were rich before, but now we literally just found blocks of diamond. Yeah, we're really rich. And uh, you never know when you're gonna need a bunch of diamonds. So why don't we just grab a couple of these? Wait, but Tora, look what you're standing on. Netherite, netherite, yes. Oh my gosh, wait, yeah, Jordy, we are sitting on netherite, which means we didn't even need to smell all that netherite because we just got so much of it down here. Give it to me. Jordy, what is your obsession with netherite? Why do you love netherite so much? I mean, it's- It's netherite! I mean, I guess it's pretty good, but I feel like you're going kind of crazy over this netherite. I think we should just keep on continuing to the very end. And wait a minute, is that even a crafting table level? That's so weird. Okay, well, uh, if we need a bunch of crafting tables, it looks like we have a bunch now. And wait a minute, we made it to end stone? And uh, I think we're almost at the bottom, Jordy. Yeah, we're getting really close. Titan Speaker Man, are you so excited to see your baby? We're gonna get him! I can't wait to not see you guys again, that's for sure. What? What do you mean by that? Come on, we've kind of become friends by now. There's no way you still don't trust me. I don't know about we. Uh, but Tor, what's that noise? Uh, what noise, Jordy? What are you talking about? And wait a minute, oh my gosh, we made it to a room! And what the heck is that the end portal? And oh my gosh, I fell, Jordy! And uh, there's so many mobs! Jordy, help! Okay, that's not good. Uh, what even are these skeletons? These are super creepy! Is that a centipede? Oh my gosh! What? Oh my gosh, there is like a centipede in here and he poisoned me. Okay, wait, these guys must be helping protect G-Man. Okay, Jordy, well, it looks like there's just a couple more spiders in the corner. And where's Titan Speaker Man? Why isn't he helping us? I don't know, I think he's scared. You guys realize you only made the hole tall enough for you two, right? You still kind of left us with all these mobs that we had to fight. Yeah, that wasn't very nice. Sucks for you guys. Should have made it taller for me. Whatever. Did we actually make it to the bottom of this one chunk? God, I hope so. And yeah, we did make it to the bottom because there's only bedrock under us. And I do not see G-Man anywhere, so I think he went into the end. How do we get there? 
Uh, I actually got some eyes from the lucky block. Oh Look. my gosh, wait, yeah, that's literally perfect, Jory. That's so lucky. And it looks like you got just enough that we can actually get through. Let's see if they work. Well, guys, we probably are gonna have to fight the Ender Dragon and then we'll find G-Man after that. So are you guys ready? Yeah, anything to get my kid back. Yeah, I'm so ready. Well, here goes nothing. I'll go ahead and throw these eyes of Ender into the portal frame just like this. Whoa. And the portal is made. Here goes nothing. Let's go save your baby. Let's go. What the heck? Where are we? Okay, we made it to the end. This is perfect, but it looks like we have to actually make a little staircase to get all the way up just like this. And uh, now we should be able to just go all the way up here. Where's that ender dragon? We got to take him out. And what the heck? Is there even lucky blocks at the end now? That's so weird. And what the heck is that? Well, well, well. Look who finally decided to show up. This is the end of the road for you three and your little journey you were on. So, tight speaker man, any last words for your kid? <laughs> hey, wait. Is that my son? Oh my gosh, wait, yeah, I think that's your son in this cage right here. My boy. Dad, Dad, you're finally here. Please save me. Tight speaker man, if we want to get your kid back, we're going to have to kill G-Man Toilet. And uh, to kill G-Man Toilet, we're going to have to take out all the different pillars, but uh, we have no projectiles. Well, actually, I got some bows from a lucky block, so here you go. <gasps> Wait, oh my gosh, that's literally perfect. Yes, let's go. And you have 64 arrows. Okay, this is great. Well, Time Speaker Man, do you have a bow as well? Yeah, I got one from the lucky block. All right, guys, well, we've all got bows, so let's split up and start taking out all the different towers. All right, I'll go this way. All right, I'll get these ones over here. I'll start over here. And it looks like Titan Speaker Man's trying to take that one out too. But, uh, oh my gosh. Oh no, watch out for the particles. <gasps> this is not good. My health is so low. <laughs> I almost got you. And maybe this lucky block will give us something that can help us. And what the heck? <clears throat> Wait a minute, guys. I think we actually got all the pillars. Yep, they're all done. All right, well, that means that now that all the pillars are gone, we have to focus all of our attacks on the G-Man toilet. This is for my son. Come on, let's go take him out. And what the heck, Enderman? What are you doing? My fight is not with you. Get away from me. All right, guys, let's go take him out. Come on. And yes, I got a really good hit. <clears throat> you think that hurts? And while all of us shooting together, we're doing so much damage. Come on, let's get him halfway. All right, guys, he's getting super low. Let's take him out. Okay, you're starting to make me angry. This is for the tight speaker, baby. Come on. Yeah, let's for tight speaker, baby. Like one more shot, guys. We got this. And who's going to get it? I want to get, get the finishing blow. I want to get the finishing blow. Come on. Yeah, that tickles. Where is it? It might be right there. I think I got it. And yeah, maybe that was me. I don't know. I don't know who got it. But still, we took him out. Let's go. <laughs> and yes, we took him out. Let's go. Oh my gosh, yes. We did it. And oh wait, my son. <gasps> oh my gosh, yeah, your son's free. My boy. Dad, Dad, you freed me, thank you. But uh, why are you with these humans? Well, uh, you may be shocked, but these humans actually helped me. What? But, but humans, they're, they're the bad guys. Well, not these ones. Come on, son, we need to go. And wait, guys, we made it back to the normal world. Let's go. Let's go. Thanks, Daddy. If you guys enjoyed that video and you want to watch the next one, make sure to click the video on the screen right now. Who are they talking to?